If you've spent any time in a gym, you've likely heard people talk about creatine monohydrate. It can be very confusing to figure out what exactly it is and how it does what it does, but we're here today to discover more about this ingredient. Creatine monohydrate is a naturally occurring molecule that's created by our kidneys and stored within our muscles. It can be sourced through the diet, mainly through animal products, but it's very difficult to consume enough to obtain the benefits the supplementation can offer. It's one of the most well-researched supplements available on the market, with well over 1,000 peer-reviewed articles available online. Research shows that it can improve performance, increase muscle mass, and also reduce the time to fatigue. There are lots of different creatines available on the market, but today we're going to focus purely on creatine monohydrate. So, where do we get our creatine from? Before the finest creatine powder travels to our raw warehouse, two main ingredients have to go to a specialist lab, sodium sarcosinate and cyanamide. Sodium sarcosinate is very much like salt, but it's not salty in taste, it's actually quite sweet. Cyanamide is a white solid, it's more commonly found in everyone's bathroom, at home in a tube of toothpaste. These two ingredients hold the key to our very helpful supplement, creatine. Together, they're heated and pressurised in a large reaction vessel. The liquid that's created is then taken out, cooled and set into crystalline creatine. This is then purified by centrifuge, spinning out any unwanted impurities. This pure liquid is then vacuum dried and milled into a fine powder to make it even easier to dissolve in water. And then it's all tested to make sure it really is as pure as we want it in the lab before being ready for us here at the My Protein Factory. And this is where we start, here at the My Protein Factory. Here we have just two and a half tons of creatine, a very small amount that we get through every single day. It's all recorded by date of arrival, but it won't be sat here for very long before it's off to the weigh room to get it ready. For creatine, it's a really simple process and it's even faster for us to produce. Every batch will use several hundred kilos of raw material, full pallets worth, and next to no raw material can go to waste. Unlike our other products, blending isn't required, so the raw material can be deposited straight into our IBCs, where the IBCs are then transferred over to our packaging line, where the raw material is then deposited through sieving straight into the pouches. Pouches are then sealed, x-rayed and scanned for quality assurance. And then transferred over to our warehouse, ready for distribution. And there you have it, job complete. Ready to go out into the world to service millions of customers around the globe. Thank you for watching and see you next time.